All right, these are my NFL picks weeks 12 through 14, and I'm just going to get right at it. So on the buys, you're talking, these are the, uh, the two teams that are supposed to be playing Mexico, uh, Chargers and Chiefs, plus the Vikings and Cardinals. Uh, Thursday night game, I believe this would be the last Thursday night game um, before Thanksgiving. I would take the uh, Texans over the Colts. Um taking the Steelers over the Bengals. Um, Broncos and Bills. Um, we're going to take the Broncos at this point. Um, I'm going to go with the Browns. And I think at this point the Dolphins will have moved on from Fitzpatrick. Uh, the problem is will Rosen be the replacement? They could be looking at drafting a quarterback. We are going to go with the Jets over the Raiders. And coming off the bye, I'm going to take the Titans over the Jags. Now, um, for uh, the uh, Sunday games, I'm going to take the Patriots, bouncing back and beating the Cowboys. The Bears coming off of the uh, the bye of the Giants um, should beat the Giants. I'm going to take the Falcons over the Bengals, though I think by this point in the season, the Bengals, uh, excuse me, the Falcons, yeah, the Bucks. Yeah, the Falcons over the Bucks. Though at this point, I think the Bucks maybe have a new quarterback at this point. Um, we're going to take the Redskins over the Lions. We're going to take the Saints over the Panthers. I'm going to take the Niners on Sunday night. I believe that's a Sunday night game. Yep. Nope, it's not. The Sunday night game is the Eagles and the Seahawks. Seahawks coming off of a bye. Going to Philly, I'm going to take the Seahawks. And the Monday night game, I'm going to take the Rams over the Raiders. Rams over the Ravens. Now, week 13... And we are in Thanksgiving this week. And I believe we are done with the buys. We'll start with the uh, Thanksgiving order. So um, we're going to take the uh, Bears over the Lions. Now the short week Thursday rules are a little different on Thanksgiving. So the Lions actually tend to do well on Thanksgiving. But I think the Bears, which will be playing possibly for a buy at this point, will be winning that game. Now we're doing the 4 o'clock game. Um, Bills and Cowboys. Cowboys should win and be on their way to trying to get at least a playoff spot. And then the Sunday night or the uh, Thursday NBC game, we are going to take the Saints, who should be trying to close out on making the playoffs. Um, I'm going to take the Giants over the Packers. And at this point, I think this is when uh, Mr. Duke will be starting for the Giants. And that should be his first win over the pack. We're going to take the Panthers over the Redskins. I'm going to take the Rams over the Cardinals. And I'm going to take the Vikes over um, the Seahawks. Um, I'm going to take the Eagles over the Dolphins, who will be, Eagles at this point, will be fighting for the playoffs. We're going to take the Jags over the Bucks, And we are going to take the Ravens over the Niners. And uh, in the AFC games, we're going to take the Jets over the Bengals. I'm going to take the Chiefs coming off the bye over the Raiders. I'm going to take the Colts over the Titans. Um, coming off of their bye, I'm going to take the Chargers. I'm going to take the Steelers over the Browns. And I'm going to take uh, the Texans over the Patriots. And uh, usually do the Monday night game last, but I guess I did that one out of order. Now we're going to go to week 14. Again, no teams coming off the bye. The, uh, on the Thursday night game, and this may be the, the last Thursday night game of the year, or at least the last one on Fox. Um, we're going to take the Bears over the Cowboys, and that could decide a bye at this point. And that's going to be a pretty big Thursday night game. We're going to take the F Panthers over the Falcons. I'm going to take the Pack over the Redskins. I'm going to take the Niners over the Saints in an upset. I'm going to take the Vikes over the Lions. And I'm going to take the Rams over Seattle. And I think the Rams are going to be trying to make that charge to make the playoffs. Uh, I'm going to take the Bucks over the Colts. And uh, that's a pretty big upset. But I think the new quarterback at that point for the Bucks will surprise. He's going to be playing for a job. And you know what? You're not going to have a, t a guy, a team win ten games in a row, um, like the Colts did at the end of last season. 
And I'm going to take um, the Steelers over the Cards. I'm going to take the Ravens over the Bills. The Browns are fighting for a playoff spot. And they are uh, on the fringes, and they're going to beat the Bengals. I'm going to take the Jets over the Dolphins. I'm going to take the Texans over the Broncos. Um, I'm going to take the Jags over the Chargers. I'm going to take the Patriots over the Chiefs. And I am going to take... Um, I'm going to take the Redskins over the Raiders. Or let's go the Raiders over the Titans. Now in week uh, 15... And, uh, yeah, we'll do week 15. So this is good. I guess we're going to do four weeks on this one. Thursday night, we're going to take the G... Hmm. I'm going to take the Jets over the Ravens. It's a rare, but it's a, it's such a close distance that the Jets should be able to make it. The Jets are going to be playing for... I believe they are playing for the division and possibly a bye. I am going to take the Bengals over the Patriots. We'll see how that pans out for my picks. I may be a psychotic at this point. I'm going to take the Chiefs over the Broncos. I'm going to take the Steelers over the Bills. I'm going to take the Texans over the Titans. And I'm going to take the Jaguars over the Raiders. I think I missed one from the week before. Let me just check. Yes, I did not do the Monday night game. I'm going to take the Eagles over the Giants. And then back to week 15. Short week, I'm going to take the Giants over the Bill over the over the Dolphins, which will eliminate the Dolphins from the playoffs at that point. I'm going to take the Cards over the Browns. Um, I'm going to pick for the Sunday night game. I'm going to take the Chargers over the Vikings. I'm going to take. Um, let me see here. I am going to take the Lions over the Bucks because of the extended time they have for. Um, with the Thursday game. I'm going to take the Bears over the Pack, which should give the Bears the division. I'm going to take the Seahawks over the Panthers. I'm going to take the Eagles over the Redskins, the Falcons over the Niners, and I'm going to take the Cowboys over the Rams, and then Monday night, uh, which could decide a playoff spot, I'm going to take the Colts. So going over here, as of this point, I have the Bears as the number one seed. I have the Panthers winning the South with the Vikings and Saints in the hunt for a playoff spot. I have the Eagles winning the East, and they would I think they would clinch it at that point with the Cowboys trying to only get a wild card spot. And I have Seattle winning the West. They would have clinched it with a bye. Or at least they would have clinched the division at that point. I have the Chiefs as the number one team with the Chargers on the outside of the playoffs. I have the Jets winning the East. And I have the Patriots not in the playoffs as of this point. I have three teams from the South. The Texans, Colts, and Jaguars all with the potential to win it. And I have the Steelers winning the North with the Ravens as a potential wildcard team. Though becoming less and less likely and the Browns out of the playoffs. That's right. As of right at this point, I do not think the Patriots are a playoff team. Let's see in if week 16 and 17 if I do. I also have some rules for that week for those two games uh, when you're making picks whether you're doing it at the beginning of the season or if you're like me as when I do it or if you'd like to gamble on it, uh, how to pick those weeks. So 16 and 17 will be next. Thanks.